That's the one I killed in the front yard. <laughs> Gene Beal loves everything about living and working in a picturesque rural setting. I like to hunt. I like to fish. I'm an outdoorsman. Five, six, seven. No, it's nine. Both his hobbies and his work as a tree trimmer keep him in excellent physical health. But when his heart started racing with no warning, he knew something was wrong. I thought, well, what's going on? You can feel it. I mean, it's, it's the worst feeling in the world. Any dizzy spells or passing out? At University of Missouri Healthcare, Dr. Sandeep Gautam, a cardiac electrophysiologist, diagnosed Beale with atrial fibrillation. In this condition, the top chamber of the heart goes completely haywire and loses any communication with the bottom chamber. Gautam says AFib is becoming more common as our population ages. Beal tried a series of medications, but his symptoms would suddenly return without warning. He knew he needed more than a temporary fix. It bothers you, you know, knowing, well, is my heart going to beat right today? Gautam recommended a procedure called catheter-based ablation. It's not major heart surgery. It's considered a minor invasive procedure. The primary goal of the procedure is to cauterize the muscle around these veins so as to trap the electricity inside the veins and prevent it from triggering atrial fibrillation. And this is my deer I killed last year. It took Beal less than a week to completely recover from the procedure and get back to his favorite activities. I've never doubted it. I've never felt the flutter. I've never felt the AFib. I don't take any medication for it. And uh, it's, it's been wonderful. From the University of Missouri, I'm Teresa Snow.